Hi, and welcome to Cat Run Figures. I'm your host, Caitlin, and today we are going to be discussing uh, Marvel and Fox. They're, they're in talks, they're in communications. So there's been a lot of speculation as to what this could potentially mean. A lot of people believe that it has to do with X-Men. It could potentially have to do with Fantastic Four or the Fantastic Four's villains, at least. Um, and potentially either sharing custody of a lot of these characters or bringing them back into the MCU entirely. Um, now this is very exciting for a lot of fans out there, including myself, who kind of, it's kind of been hit or miss with the X-Men, uh, with casting choices, um, wardrobe choices, uh, you know, everything from their suits to their actions to their powers. There's been a lot of things that a lot of people have had issues with one way or the other. Well, um, it's, it's been confirmed that uh, Fox has no, has no real interest in renewing any of the contracts of any of the current actors that they have in their X-Men verse after, after Logan. After Logan, that's it. So, what could this possibly mean for us and why in the world are we excited about this? Well, this means not only are we looking at a potential reboot for all these characters, but this could potentially mean new characters could get brought into the light. Um, you know, we all love Wolverine. We all love Wolverine, but let's face it, it's basically been the Wolverine show. Um, when it's not Wolverine, it's Mystique. But you know what? There's so many other characters that they could touch on in the realm of mutants. I know a lot of people have thrown out the world, have thrown out the name Dazzler. She's a fantastic choice. My own personal preference would be Magic, aka uh, Ileana Rasputin. Um, I'd love to see uh, her and Colossus together in a film. Hell, I'd even love to see her with Storm in a film. Um, you know, there's so many minor characters or even bigger characters that they never even touched on, like Magic. Um, I, I just have to mention her because she's my favorite X-Men. But, um, you know, as you can tell, because I have the Kotobukiya statue for her. But, um, you know what? This could mean so many amazing things. I mean, look at what Marvel did to Spider-Man. I mean, look at what they did to the Avengers, which, honestly, before they came out with the film series, was arguably a losing title for years. I mean, they completely revamped it, they completely redid the whole run, and it's a huge success. It's worked out for the comics, it's worked out for this, it's worked out for that. Um, I think this could also be true because they are redoing all of the X-Men in comics right now. Uh, like I did the video a while back, if you'll check one of the older video I did up an offer about that, where um, we learned about the new teams they're coming out with, X-Men Blue, X-Men Gold, the new Cable book that's going to be coming out. There's several other books. Iceman's getting a book. Uh, Jean Grey's getting a book. Um, yeah, I'd love to see more characters brought out if they are, in fact, going to be doing a relaunch or just having Marvel take custody of them. Um, I'm excited. Uh, the sky's the limit. You know what? Bring as many crazy characters as you want to. We will definitely go see it if Marvel has anything to do with an X-Men film. Um, yeah, so comment below and tell me what X-Men character you would love to see in a film or on television or just what character haven't they touched on that you would love to see moving forward? And uh, are you excited about the possibility of Marvel taking custody or at least helping with the creative process <laughs> with the X-Men characters? Um, so uh, give me a like if you liked this video and uh, subscribe to my channel if you'd want if you'd like more comic book content or check out any of my older videos I have up for offer like I said like I said earlier I did do a video about the upcoming X line of X titles in resurrection uh, that's coming up so yeah until next time this has been Catrin figures I'm your host Caitlin bye